Hey everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use copy.ai for copywriting. We're going to be taking an in-depth look at Copy AI, covering everything that you need from signing up to the actual use of the tool. So hopefully by the end of this video, you'll know exactly what this tool can do for you and how to get started with it. So let's get right into the video. First things first, let's walk through getting registered with Copy AI. The process only takes a minute or two. So to start, navigate to copy.ai and then click the sign up button right here. And then you have the choice between using your Google account or registering directly with your email address. I prefer connecting services via Google when possible. So I'm going to pick that option. After confirming the permissions to share Google profile information, I just need to accept Copy AI's terms of service. And that's all that it takes. The registration process is very quick and painless. When you first sign in, Copy AI provides a brief survey to capture some basic details about what you plan to use the tool for. And this helps tailor the onboarding experience. The questions are optional though, so you can skip ahead and start using Copy AI immediately. But providing some high level details allows them to showcase more relevant use cases and templates to help you get value faster. Next up, we're going to be talking about the pricing and plans available. So Copy AI stands out by offering a free tier with some great baseline capabilities. Their unlimited paid plan then builds on the core free features for power users. But with the free basic account, you receive 2000 words generated every month and access to 90 plus copywriting tools, ability to create unlimited projects and so much more such as the blog wizard content tools. And for informal use or smaller content volumes, the basic plan should cover most needs, especially given its free price tag. 2000 monthly words allow you to have Copy AI help generate or refine multiple pieces of short form content. However, users regularly producing blogs, articles, scripts, or books will likely need to upgrade to the pro plan and this price per month. And by upgrading, you will unlock additional benefits like support for up to five team members, a full suite of 90 plus Copy AI writing or copy tools, and of course, you can upgrade beyond just English and that's one of the biggest features that you can have with the paid plans, AI power transcription and translation and unlimited word count generation. So being able to intake content, media or documents in other languages, whether written or spoken and translate output using AI is incredibly unique capability. It opens up many doors for using Copy AI in non-English locals. So while the free basic access will suit many people, the enhanced paid plan capabilities take things to another level at a very affordable price. And this definitely assesses your unique needs to decide which works best for you. And now that we know the plans and the pricings, let's dive a little bit deeper into what Copy AI actually lets you do. After logging in, you land on the tool's central dashboard, and this houses all the key features conveniently in one spot. I'm going to briefly explain each main section across the top of the screen and then demo some use cases in more detail. First of all, you have the real-time search, which lets you get AI-generated summaries, ideas, and content around trending topics, personalized concepts, or anything else that you specify. You also see predefined searches to kickstart suggestions. Next up, you have the projects panel, which allows managing all of your copy AI activities around discrete ideas, documents, or campaigns in one place, so anything that the AI produces can be grouped under a common project. After that, we have the info base, which enables you to define prompts once and reuse them indefinitely when engaging Copy AI. And this, as you can imagine, saves a lot of time having to re-explain the complex instructions, background, parameters, etc. every single time. And then finally, we have the main chat interface, and this is where you actively engage the Copy AI assistant by entering prompts and reviewing the content it produces in response. And now on to some specific examples for how these features work in practice. Let's try a real-time search first. I'm going to ask Copy AI to summarize the latest news around advances in AI and machine learning technology. And as you can see, it pulled in very recent coverage from the past day or two and provided concise highlights around key developments, companies, and implications. Because Copy AI integrates directly with the live web to process requests, it can incorporate emerging information faster than datasets powering some other AI tools. And this allows for incredibly relevant up-to-date summaries on fast moving topics using Copy AI's real-time search. You could apply a similar approach to get quick overviews of trending news for sports, entertainment, business, politics, or anything with frequent updates. And then onto the base information, earlier I created a detailed background prompt explaining parameters around assessing and reviewing psychological tests and assessments. 
And rather than retyping those every time I want Copy AI to generate content related to the prompt details, I can just reference the title of the saved prompt like this. And as you can see, this allows Copy AI to leverage the full background details that I provided up front in generating its response. So even though my actual prompt was short, it could pull from the full context saved in my info base. Going over the project's capability, I can select a new project and set up one called Health Blog Ideas. And then within this project, I can ask Copy AI to generate headlines, outlines, and other content strictly focused around health-related blog topics. Everything stays very neatly organized. And then from then on, I can continually append new subtasks to this health blog project bucket without starting completely from scratch each time. The context sticks around to inform future content generation. And finally, you can have a demo of the chat, the main interface for engaging directly with Copy AI. Let's say you want some ideas for email promo to advertise an upcoming bicycle race. I can enter that prompt and then let Copy AI work its magic. And as you can see, the AI assistant can provide you with a relevant draft promo email that you could customize and then send out to people registering for such event. And should you want to try a different creative approach, you can simply clear the context and then re-engage Copy AI through the chat, or you can save what's been generated already under a project and then start fresh, so lots of flexibility. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope that this overview has given you a good feel for how Copy AI works and how you can use it. Let us know if you have any other questions in the comment section down below. And if you've enjoyed today's video, then give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you don't miss out on any follow-up content that we can make related to this one.